Ah, the moon! So fascinating, beautiful, round, and mysterious. Hmm. We are going to learn about what the moon is, and we will get to know all of its phases. Welcome to the fun world for kids! Hello friends! I am going to tell you the most incredible thing about our fascinating moon. The first thing you should know is that the moon is a natural satellite. And a satellite is an object that orbits around a planet. That means that it goes around and around without stopping. The second thing you should know is that it is always rotating around the Earth. This movement is called revolution and it also rotates on its same axis or position and this movement is called rotation. And both movements, revolution and rotation, take 28 days. And since both movements have the same duration, we can only see one side of the moon at all times. Interesting, right? But, have you noticed that some nights the moon looks different in the sky? Let's find out why. The first thing is that satellites like the moon do not have their own light. Surely you wonder, so how is it that we see it so illuminated at night? Well, we see the moon only because the sunlight is reflected off its surface. Every 28 days or so, the moon goes around the Earth once. And while this happens, the moon will receive more or less illumination from the sun, which makes us see it differently in the sky some nights. These changes of the moon, guys, are called the moon phases, or phases of the moon. Let's get to know them. There are four. New moon. This happens when the moon is between the sun and the earth. The illuminated face is in the direction of the sun and the dark side is in the direction of the earth. Therefore, we do not see it. Waxing crescent. It happens three or four days after the new moon and a part of the illuminated face of the moon is in the direction of the earth so we can see it in the sky. A trick to identify it is that it looks like the letter D. Full Moon This happens when the Earth is between the Moon and the Sun and they are aligned. That is why we see the entire half of the Moon illuminated, plump, and we see it complete in the sky. Waning Crescent This phase, little friends, is the opposite of the waxing crescent because we just see the other half of the Moon that was not visible in the first quarter. It is called waning because with the passing of the days its light diminishes and a trick to identify it is that in this phase it looks like the letter C. Fascinating, right? Let's review guys. The phases of the moon are new moon, waxing crescent, full moon, waning crescent. This is like the phases of the moon in real life. Beautiful! And here is my last important piece of information about the moon. Did you know that on July 16, 1969, the Apollo 11 space mission was launched? And on July 20th, Neil Armstrong stepped on the moon for the first time. How interesting! Thank you for watching our video. Did you like what you learned? Subscribe and find many more videos so you can learn while having fun. You can also watch this video in Spanish on our channel Mundo Divertido de Niños. The link is in the description. Lots of love! Bye bye!